Can you answer these true and false statements about the Krebs cycle? Be ready with the pause button. I'm going to go over the answer after each statement. The Krebs cycle occurs in the inner membrane space of mitochondria. Is this true or false? This is false. The Krebs cycle occurs in the mitochondrial matrix. The Krebs cycle is also known as the citric acid cycle. Is this true or false? This is true. It's actually also known as the TCA cycle as well. NADH and FADH2 are generated during the Krebs cycle. Is this true or false? This is true. Both of these electron carriers are produced at this step. The Krebs cycle produces more ATP than any other step in cellular respiration. Is this true or false? This is false. It actually only makes one ATP per turn, two ATP per glucose, so it doesn't really make a lot of ATP. The Krebs cycle directly uses oxygen in its reactions. Is this true or false? This is false. Oxygen isn't directly involved. However, it is an aerobic process, basically because it needs the recycling of NAD and FAD from the electron transport chain. Carbon dioxide is released during the Krebs cycle. Is this true or false? This is true. For each turn of the Krebs cycle, two CO2 molecules are produced. The regeneration of oxaloacetate makes the Krebs cycle cyclic. Is this true or false? This is true. The four carbon oxal acetate is going to combine with acetyl CoA, and whenever that happens, it needs to be regenerated. So, this process is a cycle since it goes around in a turn and just basically regenerates that four carbon molecule. And here's the last one the Krebs cycle is unique to animal cells. Is this true or false? This is false. The Krebs cycle in cellular respiration occurs in plants, fungi, and other organisms, so it's not just in animal cells. 